The roll again. Here we are. It's a series now. How did you go into this different than the actual film? Um, well, this time I got a chance to really peel back the layers of who Tupac was. Um, and my, my job in Straight Outta Compton was just to really show his, his uh, excitement in the studio. You know, um, but with this, we get 10 episodes, like you said, and we really get to show uh, who Tupac was and his relationship with his friends and his family, how his death affected his mom. You, you see a lot of stuff, as well as learn a lot of new details about the murder. So, yeah. Did you come into this having your vision of what things were and your perspective? And obviously, we see his brother here. Are you guys close now? Right. Yeah, that's family, man. I call him Uncle Mo. Now we got Mark here. He said you guys are like family now. What was it like? Yeah. 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 When you yeah. <laughs> when you see him play, you know, this is not his first time portraying your brother. When you see this now, this limited series that's coming out, we're getting more answers, more details. How does that make you feel to still see these, the story out there and letting more generations know about it? Well, we knew, Pac knew, we knew we were on a legendary track. Um, no one knew how it was going to end. And it hasn't ended because the legacy lives on. Yeah. Brothers like Mark, Wavy, learning the good, learning the bad, learning the 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 the, the mistakes, learning from the mistakes, yeah. and, and try to improve on all of us, all, on our communities, the hip hop community, the black community, poor uh, and disenfranchised communities. The human race, we all need. Ex exactly, exactly. Um, that's sort of what our movement was about, you know, that was one of the, 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 the aspects. But, you know, I'm, my job is to be a brother to brothers. So I'm trying to help the brothers get on the right track, learn from Pac's story, our story, and have this production do it the best way possible, you know. Um, you know, because I know everybody wants to talk about the story. You know, we are like the, uh, you know, this story is similar to the to the Capone stories of the, the, the 20s and 30s, you know? Yeah, so, of our generation, and we, we were it. So I just want them to get it right as possible because Pac's my brother, my loved one, and um, if they're gonna tell it, tell it, you better tell it right. Big shoes to fill over here. Big shoes, big shoes. <laughs> Are you taking it all in right now? I am, I am. It's, look at this car, but this is crazy. Look at all the cash mates and, and the crew members. This is epic. I'm, I'm so excited. Like, I'm overwhelmed right now, really. It is an overwhelming feeling. I mean, besides just the shoes that you got to fill, like the cast that you're also working with and the story. Yeah, like this this whole thing, like like Tupac and Biggie mean a lot to the culture. And, and, and I'm so with this project because it's going to bring closure to a lot of families, a lot of fans, and everybody that wondered what happened. To, to Tupac and Biggie, and, and this series is definitely going to do it for them. Definitely. Are we going to see more of you? We're gonna, you're not going to stop. Of course, can't stop, won't stop, you know? <laughs>